Pro Football Weekly is grading every team in the league on their post-lockout moves. Right now we're talking about the NFC West. The Arizona Cardinals had a lot of moves they needed to make, and they did, but still, you gave them a B-. I did. I gave them a B- compared to last year's F when they lost guys like Bolden and, and Roll and Dansby. Yeah. This is a big improvement. You know, bringing in Kevin Cobb, huge upgrade at quarterback. Even if he isn't a superstar, they were so bad at that position last year. And then good locker room guys like Heap and Darren College, you know, Stuart Bradley, if he comes around, big improvements. <laughs> I think you want to build that winning atmosphere. You certainly lose on guys like Rodgers Cromarty and Breston leaving, but overall an upgrade. Ultimately, it will come down to the quarterback. If Cobb yeah. is as good as they think, then it'll be a good offseason for them. San Francisco 49ers, not a lot of action. Some late moves, but you gave them a C. Yeah, I think in losing tough guys like David Boss at guard and, and, and Takeo Spikes yeah. and Abreu Franklin, lost a lot on defense. Where's the quarterback help? I mean, we have Alex Smith again, and maybe it's Colin Kaepernick's time in, in, uh, in a few years, but... <laughs> You know, I just don't know if they made enough improvements. Braylon Edwards could help, but uh, I have some questions about this group. Yeah, it was really bad for a little while, a little recovery late. We'll see. The Seattle Seahawks who gave them a B, another one of those teams like the Cardinals, one of the most active in free agency. Yeah, splashy moves like Sidney Rice, Zach Miller, Robert Gallery. I think those will help. But again, quarterback's the issue. Is Tavares Jackson going to be enough? I don't know if they's going to be able to get the ball to the key players. So, you know, some nice moves, but a few questionable ones kind of sprinkled in enough to keep that grade down. Yeah, ultimately, similar to the Cardinals, it'll be the quarterback play that really decides it for that team. And finally, the St. Louis Rams, the most improved team in that division last year, and pretty good offseason, gave them a B. Yeah, no big splashes, but good players. Guys like Quentin Michael, Harvey Dahl, they're going to yeah. be a tougher team. They got some running back help for Steven Jackson. I think the veteran depth on defense they acquired will uh, make this a better football team. And quietly, some wide receivers, not big yeah. names, but a little more help there for for Sam Bradford. That is a look at the NFC West and the moves they made for full coverage of the NFL. Check us out at ProFootballWeekly.com.